Sushant Sinha has mocked the Hindu Holocaust, stating that those who fail to watch the film should go to jail for two years and those criticizing it for life. Yashwant Sinha, the TMC leader, saying it's not enough to make the film The Kashmir Files tax-free all over India. The parliament should pass a law making its viewing compulsory for all Indians and those who fail to watch it should go to jail for two years. Let's go across to Nakul, who's joining us with more details on this. Uh, well, Nakul, all this while we saw the Congress leaders uh, mocking and denying the genocide. Now we have the TMC leader, Yashwant Sinha, as well, wading in and uh, saying that it should be made compulsory and mocking the genocide. Yes, of course, uh, time and again we have seen that the leaders of opposition, they have raised, uh, the, uh, raised the question of the, the, that the movie is inciting violence. At the same time, we need to ask them that when is the time is they going to stand in solidarity with what the Kashmiri Pandits have faced in 1990. Remember uh, the exodus that happened that, that at that time also there was, a there was a target on one particular community. That's one thing that uh, the leaders of opposition are forgetting at this time and they are raising questions on uh, this event. At the same time, Yashwan Singh who has put it out and said that the movies may, should be made compulsory. Well, of course, Well, uh, at the same time, we need to understand that watching a movie depends on uh, personal choice. At the same time, you cannot make it compulsory. But uh, we, what we have learned is that more than 10 states have made the movie tax-free. Uh, a movie which has come out uh, after a very long time, which shows the truth, which is, uh, which prevail, which is prevailing, and uh, the truth that happened in the 1990s, showing the exodus and atrocities that happened on Kashmiri Hindus. At the same time, we have spoken to a lot of Kashmiri Hindus who have the who were the eyewitnesses uh, at the, uh, who have faced the atrocities. They they are uh, they they have a the very different version of what what was what happened, and they are saying that uh, we, you cannot neglect the fact that, that there is a, there are a lot of tears in their eyes, and of course uh, a retired IPS officer also had uh, put it out saying uh, that the, the truth is more devastating than than uh, what what is shown in the movie. Of course, uh, it raises concern right. that why opposition uh, 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 is. Uh, questioning uh, uh, on why the movie That's is right. um, inciting violence, but we need to understand that uh, violence that happened in 1990 was also uh, targeted on one particular Absolutely. community. So, uh, you know, the political slugfest that's going on about it now, uh, what happened back in the 90s, no justice yet.